There is something unusual happening in Kenya's Rift Valley Lake. Lake Baringo is rising at about two and a half centimeters a day. More than 3,000 families Lake displaced. Lake Bogoria, so swollen from rising. The two lakes were 20 kilometers apart. Lake Naivasha. The level of the lake started increasing. Every lake right now is going crazy. For context, the lakes are in Kenya's Rift Valley, which is part of the East African Rift Valley which is part of what is known as the Great Rift Valley system that stretches all the way to the Middle East. And wherever the Rift Valley passes through, it leaves a series of lakes, rivers and mountains, including Mount Nyiragongo, which recently erupted in Congo. That's how we have these lakes. But the lakes are now expanding its boundaries like never before. According to experts, this is caused by the increase in average rainfall levels in the past three years around the catchment areas, coupled with the fact that there is continued deforestation in those areas. These two factors cause more water to flow to the lakes. I was curious to see whether these changes over the years have been captured by the satellites above us, and if so, do a time lapse and see how it looks like. I looked up on Google Earth and lucky enough it had historical images of these lakes, which I downloaded and did this time lapse. And what it shows is interesting. Let's have a look. Let's begin way up in Lake Turkana. It's a long lake, I could only take a part of it for the difference to be visible here. The changes are clearly visible and even though they may look small, it's a real difference on the ground. You can see there has been an increase in the last few years. And then below it is Lake Baringo, one of the most affected. This time lapse shows a massive increase. This is a freshwater lake and next to it is Lake Bagoria which is saline and experts now fear that the two might meet and merge into one. Let's see what's happening in Bagoria. Although it has been increasing all around, it has particularly been expanding northwards towards Baringo. The two used to be 20 kilometers apart but now it is said to be only about 13 kilometers. And then beneath it is Lake Nakuru, the lake by Kenya's fourth largest city of Nakuru. It has undergone significant changes in water levels, which has broken into the national park as well as the settlement areas. Lake Naivasha, which supports about 70% of Kenya's flower farms, is also rising despite the fact that about 20,000 cubic meters are used daily on the flower farms which have been mushrooming over the years and this time lapse captures part of that growth. If we put all this together, it looks like this. I want to thank you for watching, make sure you subscribe and follow me because lots of cool content are in the pipeline. Cheers!